okay today what we're going to go through is a fix so hopefully i think i found a fix for i had a comment on one of the early uh, videos that i did on patterns somebody was saying how do you get rid of the white hair lines the white cross hair lines that you can see between the tiles on the patterns and normally that's not so much of an issue because it gets filled in once it gets printed but i guess if you're doing digital stuff then it still kind of shows up so how to eradicate that in affinity that seems to be an issue that hadn't necessarily been resolved anyway i spent hours today going through every possible scenario trying to find a fix for it so first things first this was a pattern tile that, that was in my last video that we created when we went through mid journey v5 and we created this nice pattern of datura flowers so first things first you want to make sure that you've got force pixel alignment on move by whole pixels on and then my snapping settings make sure you've got the enable snap on I've got my screen tolerance set for 10 and then I've got all these other settings on I haven't got baseline grid because I'm not using that that's those but you can fiddle with them anyway so let's copy this over so that's option shift and then what I do is I stop there and then I just hold the shift down and I just slide it along to make sure we get the green and the red lines come up and then let go of that to make sure that's snapped right in and then if we enlarge bring it up let's see there we are so can you see that that's on just a normal pixel view mode and then we've got the retina pixel view mode where it disappears so if we go back to the pixel mode you can see it's not always there once we enlarge it kind of disappears so it is a kind of a screen display thing really so the fix that i think i've found is if we go into the cog basically if we highlight them so if we select the images and then go into the cog blend options and change where it says inherit to force off this is the blend gamma and then deselect it's gone can you see it's not there that's in the retina the pixels are blended together and which seems to have sorted the problem out so if i do a let's see what happens if we copy this and then drag that down so that's still got the force off so that should theoretically yeah you can't see it there either let's just save this so let's just export this as a high quality should be enough let's just export that so i've we'll just opened this and as you can see it's not showing the i don't seem to be showing the crosshairs or hairlines whatever however you want to call them so i think i think that's fixed it so i think that's what you do so you go to you highlight the images and you go to the cog and you take anti-aliasing off and then that works for the whole document and then so how many times you continue it should make it all right for for the rest yeah i think it's i think it's worked hurrah <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think that's done the job, so fingers crossed, let me know how you get on. Thanks for watching. I'd love you to like and subscribe. It will really help my channel.